But man, look at that sky. <clears throat> this is the uh, river that runs along our property. Uh, it belongs to a wildlife refuge, but I mean, it's just over the line from our property. And uh, so it's in really close proximity. It's, uh, it's nice to have this uh, little source of water nearby, but also the groundwater is really shallow too. So when we go to dig a well, we should have no problem finding it. So real pretty down here. We thought we'd bring you down here and show it to you um, so that uh, you can have a moment to enjoy it like we do. Man, this is beautiful. Day. It's a nice morning. Bird just went down into those weeds. Lots of birds nesting in here. In those rushes, whatever rushes. they are. Rushes. I don't I know what. Them weeds. I don't know what they're. They look like rushes to me. I don't know what they're called. Some kind of marshy plant. Uh huh. This is the rainy season, so this is the time when. You know, these bushes get their new growth and flower and that kind of stuff. This is a creosote bush. It smells. Mm -hmm. that thing oh look at that that is pretty can you get a close-up of that can you zoom it in Off in the distance, way up there, is our, our campsite and buzz. Or whatever we decide to call it. Ball, see it? There's a green one back right there. Huh. Pretty interesting. <gasps> I stepped on a yellow flower right there. Almost. Oh, right here. Oh, it's all there are all sorts of little pretty yellow flowers. Mm -hmm. Oh look, stick tight things. Uh -huh. Here's some water.
bug issue, isn't it? Some holes here in the banks, be careful. It is kind of going. Mm -hmm, it's moving. Pretty shallow. Got to come down here during the spring freshets and see what it's like. Right now it's just kind of lazy. It's not very fast, or is it fast? Oh, I don't know. It's pretty flat ground here, not very fast. Look at that willow moseying down the river. I should say meandering, moseying, drifting. That guy got a bow or a rifle or he something? He should have a bow. It's bow season. I mean, you could have a rifle with him, too. Mm -hmm. Looks like he's packing something on his back. question is, bringing horses in here, won't that scare those elk away? I know, that's kind of weird. I mean, I wouldn't think that would be a very good... Uh... But, if they, here, I understand the <coughs> reasoning, because <coughs> they can't have ATVs, so... Right, you, and you got to cover ground. And, plus, if you shot one, how are you going to get it out of <coughs> here? Yeah, that's true. you got to pack it out. pack it out. Feels good. All right. Traipsing across the river. Just like old timey westerners. Nice and cold. I'm glad E Chip is the trailblazer. <laughs> I am a great trailblazer. E Chip has my boots, so I have no choice but to follow him. <laughs> okay, here I go. I'll probably fall in. It's nice and firm. Golly, this is some cold water. <laughs> it's moving water. It's cold. Let me turn it around so you can see the dirty foot. Bees. <laughs> yeah, they're bees. Yeah, they're buzzing right around on those yellow flowers. Uh -huh. Honeybees. Are they really? Yeah, they're European honeybees. I saw a bee over there that's more red and a different looking kind of bee, but that's a European honeybee right there. Tell the viewers about the fish find right quick. No. <laughs> We're really disappointed. <laughs> Sorely disappointed. Asian carp in this river. We didn't expect to find them this far north, but I guess they exist. It's kind of a shame. It was kind of a bummer walking all the way over to find that. <laughs>